See here, how we cross the Atlantic, catch this trade wind to where the comet's parabola comes close to the Earth. Or close enough. How come a writer knows so much about piloting and navigating? Because long before I was a writer, I was a Mississippi riverboat pilot. Hey, that's an uncommon fine frog. Well, that's Homer. You know, twas a frog like Homer that put me in the writing business. I wrote a story about the celebrated jumping frog of Calaveras County. That's right here. Home of Jim Smiley and his famous frog, Donald Webster. Famous frog? Will you tell me what in tarnation a frog could do to get himself famous? Oh, Tom. I've been trying everything I know, and I ain't even a little bit famous yet. Well, I'll tell you all about him, just as it was told to me. <coughs> What a fella, that Jim Smiley. Always betting on anything that turned up. Only thing is, he made sure he won every bet. He catched a frog one day and took him home and said he'd calculate to educate him. All a frog wants is educating, and he can do most anything. So he never done nothing for three months. Set in his backyard and learn that frog to jump. You bet he did learn him, too. All right, Daniel. Let's just see how far you can go. <laughs> Come on back now. One for accuracy. Woo-wee! <laughs> Smiley knew a sucker when he saw one. What might that be you got in the barrel? Well, it might be a parrot. Might be a canary. Maybe. But ain't. It's only just a frog. Mm. So it is. What's he good for? Well, he's good enough for one thing, I should say. He can outjump any frog in Calaveras County. Hmm. Well, I don't see no pints about that frog is any better than any other frog. Hmm. Maybe you just don't understand frogs. Anyway, I got my opinion, and I'll just rest $40 that he can outjump any frog in Calaveras County. Well. I'm only a stranger here. I ain't got no frog. But if I had a frog, I'd bet you. That's all right. I'll go get you a frog. You a hungry frog? Smiley went to the swamp and slopped around in the mud for a long time. Finally, he fetched a frog and fetched him in to give him to this fella. You, Ricky! Here it comes. Here's your frog. Put my money on Smiley's frog. Me too. Count me in. Now then, if you're ready, set him alongside of Daniel with his four paws even with Daniel's, and I'll give the word. Hey, right. on your marks, get shit, get. Come on, get it, 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 Oh, no. 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 Oh,
Jump! Jump frog! Go ahead! We won, Frog. What do you mean you won? Leave it, Miley. That was the last forty dollars I had. Well, as I said before, I don't see no pints about that frog. Is any better than any other frog? I do wonder. Why in tarnation that there frog just give up? Wonder if there ain't something the matter with him. Pears look mighty baggy somehow. I blame my cats if he don't weigh 50 pounds. Oh. <laughs> I've been hornswoggled. He was the maddest man. He took out after that fella, but he never catched him. Shucks, I could write a better story than that and Tom. That's what I said myself when I heard it. It was a big success, all the same. I became a writer. I haven't worked a day since. Now that's a job I'd like to get. If you get out of here alive. Yeah. How come you want to catch that comet so bad, Mr. Twain? Oh, ho, ho, ho. The comet and I are a part of the plan, Angelfish. Uh, no doubt the Almighty has said here. Here goes those two unaccountable freaks. They came in together. They must go out together. Here, set your eyes on this celestial schooner. Ain't that a heart-wallowing spectacle? It's cute. Well, Tom and Huck and I... Well, see, we're not so sure that... that I know what I'm doing up here? What? <laughs> well, Angel says it's just like piloting a river. You get to know the shape of it. Like following a hall at home in the dark. And even if you feel some fear, you know no harm can come to you. But you travel that hallway a hundred times. Nothing but bare feet and faith. <laughs> 